Hello everyone. Uh, today is Sunday, August 24th, and I am doing a Whole Foods grocery haul for you today to show you everything that I got from the grocery store. Before I put it away, I am then going to be making some dinners for this week, so I'm going to make a kale and onion recipe, sautéed kale and onion, and some salmon and probably some stew or something like that but I just have to look up some recipes for all the veggies I have disclaimer I'm going to be doing some juicing this week so you'll probably see stuff that um you know I might not actually use in a recipe I may just be juicing it but I'll tell you so start off this is kale like I said I'm going to be making a kale and onion recipe but I'm also going to juice that this is ginger put that in my smoothies use that in juice Celery for my juices. I don't actually like celery any way other than juiced because I just don't like the taste. But uh, this is fennel for my juice. Onions, I mean, um, lemons. This is romaine lettuce for my salads I'm going to make this week. Uh, Granny Smith apples. This is a peach. Red peppers. Onions. I use onions in a lot of different dishes, so I usually try to stock up. Uh, guacamole. Uh, some more apples, but these are not Granny Smith. These are Fiji, or Fuji apples. Uh, this is Super Greens, Organic Girl. It has red and, Swiss, red and green Swiss chard, uh, tatsoi, arugula, and spinach. Never tried it before. It was on sale. I wanted to try it. And, of course, my baby spinach. I bought that yesterday, but um, since I'm doing a grocery haul, I just put it all out so that you all could see. Uh, sharp cheddar cheese and uh, the cheddar cheese slices for breakfast. They had a sale on corn, so I stocked up. They uh, had eight ears for, I think, like a dollar, which is really good. So I got some corn, uh, small potatoes organic potatoes for recipes. Eggs that I got from Wegmans. Sorry, <laughs> put my hand over the lens. This is some more of the shredded cheese. Again, they had it on sale. This is the Siggy's yogurt. So I've been having those. They really are helping with keeping me full after my runs. As I told you, I am training for a half marathon. So trying to find Quick snacks that I can have right after the run that don't take long to prepare. So the yogurts have been great. Tomato sauce and tomato puree and tomato paste. Uh, they had coconut water and they were actually making it right in front of you. They took the coconut and they put it on the thing and the, the, the juice from the coconut came out. So this was very good. I saw them make these two bottles and I got some because it helps with recovery from my runs. Um, sparkling water because I love sparkling water and some other water and uh, my new favorite obsession when I want something to drink and I don't want water uh, the honest tea uh, unsweetened just green tea there is no sugar in it it is literally I don't know if you all can see that if that'll clear up but it literally is just green tea <laughs> so it has no calories nothing and um, like I said, I'm making my dinners for the week. So I have some boneless, skinless chicken thighs that I may use today. I may not. I may just freeze them. And um, some salmon. So that is my grocery haul. I hope you all are doing well. And I hope this was helpful. If you all have any interest in seeing my recipe with the kale, please let me know. And I will videotape it when I cook. Um, and I'll, I'll videotape it anyway. But if you all want to see it. Let me know in the comments and I'll upload it. And uh, you can let me know if you like it. I've never tried it before. So it's not on me if it's not good. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye.